Hi guys, this is a video about uh, a software, a uh, backup software, partition, partition editor in software and cloning software, which is this Awami backupper. So we're gonna go just real quick uh, through the installation. And there it is. I don't care if you get your, uh, your software patch or whatever. You can look that up yourself. So we're just gonna that's the directory where it's going to be installed. So we're gonna click install, and uh, hopefully it'll go quick. And uh, yep, I think I'm gonna pause here for a while. So here you go, guys. Uh, it says here. Uh, I'll enjoy if you want to. <laughs> it says join the UX. I don't want that. Uh, I'm just gonna close it for now and go uh, reopen it up. And uh, there it is on the desktop. So uh, when you open it up, you get this uh, interface. So this uh, first tab right here, if you want to create a new backup for uh, your partition or your hard disk. So it may uh, automatically goes to the second tab. So here you got system backup, disk backup, partition backup, file backup, all sorts of backups that you want to do. For example, uh, let us just check the system backup for instance. So you got it detects the system that we have on partition C. Now it tells you to select the target partition or the path for the backup so I don't have much space on my other plug drive so I guess I guess there is but I'm not going to do that I don't need to so you get the idea so you can choose whatever you want so disk backup that will back up the whole disk into a folder and then you can restore it when you do a backup so you'll save it then when you need when you need it you just go to restore and you select the backup uh, mainly it will show up right here or you can check the path and go to your backup image as you can see over here it's selected the tape that's the tape of the of the image and then you can select your image and do a restore you can also do that restore not uh, just using the windows utilities and uh, we get to the clone part uh, this clone uh, this is what got me to know this software uh, I was looking for I was looking to clone my hard disk and I did it well not using I used this software but it didn't work for me but it's great it might work for you because I had a problem which was the the target disk wasn't was a smaller size than the source one so you can clone your disk this is the target and this is a source and or you can select here yeah, source disk then you select the destination disk and it'll make your copy everything including the system partition and all the data that you have on the search disk to the destination disk and you can just power up your machine using the a the second disk that you clone to and you got system clone if you want to just clone the system partition or just the system and you got partition clone other that's gonna be the partition or the just a data a regular data partition uh, I guess the difference uh, for the system clone is that it will take care of the booting files and such stuff. Uh, that's my assumption. But I uh, I did try this one as well. Well, it didn't work as I said. It, I had some issues with my disks. Anyways. Uh, I got some other utilities you can check the image create a beautiful media explore image merge images uh, well 
certain tools here that you can figure out by yourself because uh, I'm not an expert at this I just uh, uh, due to a request from my from uh, from a viewer I just I'm just doing this video for that so that's pretty much about this uh, tool I think it's great uh, so try it out if you especially for the clone part I think it'll it'll go well for use uh, mainly if you have the destination disk is greater greater in size it will be fine so that's pretty much it I hope you uh, this has been useful for you and that's it